Hey Regina, it's Melissa. Told you I'd help you out with um, adding pictures to your Facebook. So, I was telling you yesterday that there are two ways to do it. You can either add a picture to your status, which you would do right here on your home page, and you go ahead, type in whatever, add a picture. Uh, you just click on this right here, and then it's going to go ahead and add a picture to your status. And the other thing I was saying was if you want to go ahead and add pictures to your profile in an album. You're going to go here, you're going to click on profile, you're going to go to photos. Once you're in there, you go ahead and create a photo album and you can name the album whatever you would like to name it and then you can go here and you can decide who's going to be able to see your pictures. Right now it's set on everyone which means anybody who does a search for you on Facebook if they find your profile, they can go ahead and look at all of your photos. I generally set it to only friends, and since I'm doing this as a tutorial for you, I'm going to set it for only me. Go ahead and click OK, and then create album. Now here you're going to see this pop-up, which may be a little bit different on yours because I'm using a Mac. So mine's a little different than a PC is probably going to look like. Now you go in, you find on mine it says my pictures which are in my iPhoto library which is this right here which is where all my pictures are stored and then you go down through and you select the folder that your pictures are in and you're probably more familiar with your own operating system so you go in pick some for some reason on here the picture is not showing up I'm not exactly sure why because I don't use this I generally go through right to my iPhoto and look at them that way and go ahead and add them. There are also these other options here, which is try the simple uploader, and then here it says use iPhoto on your Mac, check out the Facebook exporter for iPhoto, which of course it's going to be different for yours. So you can try either one of these two options. The simple uploader works great. Um, you just go through and pick which file you'd like to use. It's going to take you in go into your photos and pick the, I have all mine in folders so go ahead and just pick a folder or something choose make sure you check the box saying that you have the rights to these photos and go ahead and upload the photos um, it's going to take however long depending on your connection speed and it's going to go ahead and load those into your folder and after it does that you can go through you can edit you can change the caption for the picture you can change the name of the folder itself. Um, yeah, you can pick the uh, cover for the album, which is what people first see when they go ahead and, and look into your pictures. So that is pretty much it. Hopefully that helps you out. Um, you can go, as you can see here, um, let's just say I wanted to edit, um, let's see something dumb. Okay, go ahead, add this caption. Um, you can add who is in your photos. Um, I'm going to skip this right now. But, um, but yeah, you can go ahead and, and do all that. And hopefully this was a helpful tutorial. If you have any questions, just let me know. I'm definitely not an expert at any of these things, but um, I can try my best to help you out. And I just work through it until I figure it out and uh, we'll go from there. So I look forward to your updated pictures and talk to you later.